Coach Maggie. Before I start, let me say thank you to each and every one of you who actually took some time from your busy schedule and sent me a message letting me know how you feel about the videos that I've been putting out there. It really means a lot to me because my goal is really to share with you information that you need, information that you can use in your own relationships. Well, we all know how difficult it was for me when I did not have someone to help me. That's why I'm making this a priority to put myself out there, share the videos, answer your questions, to make sure that you guys do not have to experience what I experience in my own relationships. Well, we all know how difficult it is to live with someone, to be with someone in relationship. It is also very difficult for us to acknowledge things that we do for ourselves. When somebody, whether it's our friends or family member, does something that is nice, we are so quick to go and cheer them on and tell them, wow, I am so proud of you. And I like what you did. But when we do it, we think it's normal. We do not recognize the small achievements that we make almost on a daily basis. I know it is difficult because we are busy. Many of us are mothers. You know, we have things to do. We go to work, we take care of our kids, we take care of our family. We even take care of our friends. But we still have to make time for ourselves. That is why I'm doing these videos. This is all about self-love reminding each and every one of you how important it is to take some time to love on yourself. So my focus today will be not just loving on ourselves, but how we appreciate the small achievements that we make. Many of us, we go through life, we set goals, we tell ourselves we're going to do some things, and we work hard at it. We get up every day and we give it the best that we can. And all we do is keep trying, you know? We keep at it, we keep giving. But we never stop to say to ourselves, I may not have finished the project yet, but at least I'm halfway done. Or even if I did not finish the, pro the project yet, but at least, I started it. We're going to start acknowledging our small accomplishments because that is the path for us to actually achieve bigger success in life. When we are aware of the small steps that we make, we become encouraged to continue to move forward. Sometimes we are waiting for someone to tell us that we have done something good. Because we are practicing self-love, I'm letting you know that you don't need someone to acknowledge what you have done. Because you have the power to tell yourself, you know what? I did this. And I can pat my back. Because I did this. You know you deserve to acknowledge the sacrifice, the effort that you invested in accomplishing this goal or in completing this homework or even finding this new job. We all know how difficult it is for you and for all of us to even take the steps to do these things. So why not, why not acknowledging the small steps? Because if someone else had done exactly what you did, you would have gone and chill them up and say, congratulations, I'm so proud of you, I'm happy for you. Yeah, we're gonna do it for somebody else. 
So today, I am challenging you to do it for yourself. I'm challenging you to cheer on yourself. I'm challenging you to congratulate yourself on the small accomplishment that you have made. So we're going to understand this is not about anybody else. This is about us loving on ourselves. This is us putting ourselves first. This is us knowing our value, our worth, acknowledging the work that we've done, that we've invested, and taking pride in it, and patting our back and saying, I did this. There's nothing wrong with that. Actually, by taking the step to do that, you're not only encouraging yourself to do more, but you're letting people around you knowing that you know your worth. Therefore, they need to understand and respect you as well. So let's go, my sisters. Let's go love on ourselves. Let's pat ourselves on our back for the hard work that we have accomplished, for the investment that we've made in society, for the love that we have given to everybody, but most of all, for the sacrifices that we've done for us to be the woman that we are today. So let's not just tune on everybody. Let's start tuning on ourselves as well. I really hope that we will, each one of you who listen to this video will take some time to reflect on the things that you have done, the small achievement that you have made so far and start loving on yourself. You see, this journey is not about just looking at the end result, the complete result. This journey is acknowledging every step that you make. I really hope that you guys are going to not just listen to the video, but actually apply the things that we have just discussed. Remember, this is your journey. You have one, one shot at this thing called life. Your job is to enjoy the journey. As you're enjoying your journey, Remember, go on the website, www.owningmydestiny.com for more videos. Also, reach out to me. Email me at mkansky at owningmydestiny.com. It's always a pleasure hearing from each and every one of you. Come on, ladies. Let's go on our destiny.